Mrs. Collie Wobbles has nothing to fear from the strange and fearsome visitors that emerge from the big, dark, scary wood, not with her pet frog guarding the garden gate. Gobble! They don't hang around for long. But when Mrs. Collie Wobbles' frog demands a thank you kiss, things suddenly take a surprising turn. Let's find out what's happening in this book, Beware of the Frog, written by William B. This is a story of a sweet little old lady called Mrs. Collie Wobbles. Mrs. Collie Wobbles lives in a little house on the edge of a big, dark, scary wood. The only thing protecting Mrs. Collie Wobbles from all the horrible creatures that live in the big dark scary wood is her little pet frog. Look, there is little Mrs. Collie Wobbles hiding in her kitchen. Who has she seen coming out of the big dark scary wood? Oh dear, it's that terrible thief, greedy goblin, up to no good, out stealing from sweet little old ladies. Nicotinoo, Nicotinoo, if I get a chance, I'll steal from you. I love to steal money and shiny pretty things. I'm in and out of the house in a flash. What's this? Beware of the frog. Well, no frog will stop me getting what I want. Maybe I'll just steal that frog too. Nicotinoo, Nicotinoo, if I get a chance, I'll steal from you. And so the greedy goblin quietly opens the gate. But, oh dear, the frog doesn't look very pleased about that. Gobble. Look, there is little Mrs. Collie Wobbles hiding in her bathroom. Who has she seen coming out of the big, dark, scary wood? Oh dear, it's smelly troll, up to no good. He moves into little old ladies' houses and pong so much they have to run away. Valley, 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 I'm awfully slimy and awfully smelly. This little old lady's house is just what I have been looking for. I'll live something rotten so she'll soon run away. What's this? Beware of the frog? I'll belch and whiff and stink so much, that frog will have to hop off too. Welly, 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 I am awfully slimy and awfully smelly. And so, with a pong, Smelly Troll opens the gate. But oh dear, the frog doesn't look very pleased about that. Gobble, gobble. Look, there is little Mrs. Collie Wobbles hiding in her bedroom. Who has she seen coming out of the big, dark, scary wood? Oh dear, oh dear, it's giant hungry ogre. He's after his supper and his favorite food is sweet little old lady. Dum de dum, dum de dum. I have got a very, very hungry tum. This looks promising. My belly is rumbling and I must have my supper. A juicy old lady cooked in lots of honey and butter. 
What's this? Beware of the frog. Yum yum. That frog will taste lovely dipped in some ketchup. Dum di dum dum di dum. I've got a very very hungry tum. And so, giant hungry ogre licks his lips and opens the gate. But oh dear, the frog doesn't look very pleased about that. Gobble gobble gobble. So, that was the story of a sweet little old lady called Mrs. Collie Wobbles who lived next to a big dark scary wood. And as you can see, Mrs. Collie Wobbles no longer has to spend all her time hiding in her little house. And it's all thanks to her little pet frog. Oh my little froggy friend, how can I ever thank you? asks Mrs. Collie Wobbles. The frog has a think. How about a little kiss? suggests a frog. So Mrs. Collie Wobbles gives him a little kiss. And Hey presto! Mrs. Collie Wobbles is transformed into a sweet little old lady, Frog. But oh dear, she doesn't look very pleased about that. Does she? the end thank you for watching if you like the story don't forget to subscribe like comment and share